On this day, the soaring voices of the Selected of God Choir reverberated from the pillared atrium of downtown Detroit's historic dime building. By late summer, the sound of some 70 Chrysler Group employees will be added to the relocation of the Great Lakes Business Center here. A new commitment to downtown Detroit by Chrysler Group LLC and a new name on the front door. We at Chrysler owe a lot to the city because the people of Detroit and this region have contributed to making our company great again with their talent, with their commitment, and with their sweat. Detroit is the place that we feel at home, and that is why we're proud to say that from now on, this building is going to be known as Chrysler House. It is a name that reflects our intent to put down roots in Detroit's downtown and to take a proactive role in the building of this neighborhood. Chrysler House is the unequivocal statement that our company believes in the city of Detroit and the, and the spirit that's driving its people. Moving the Great Lakes Business Center to Chrysler House is only the latest show of commitment by Chrysler Group LLC to Detroit. In January, it was announced a third crew and 1,100 new jobs would be added to the Jefferson North Assembly Plant. SRT Viper production will crank up once again at the Connor Avenue Assembly Plant, creating 150 new jobs. Plus, Chairman and CEO Sergio Marchioni is serving as campaign chair for the United Way for Southeastern Michigan's 2012 campaign. It's all about a comeback story for both the company and the city. Chrysler knows the reality of being an underdog and then helps us relate to the city's attempt at revitalizing its future. <clears throat> Like Detroit, Chrysler knows what it's like to hear commentators pronounce our condition as being beyond the point of salvation. And to those who scoff at the idea of a revitalized Detroit, I'd remind them of what Amelia Earhart said, never interrupt someone doing, someone doing something that you told them that cannot be done. And so Chrysler defied the predictions of demise thanks to the strength and ultimately to the courage of its people. When we look at the people of Detroit, we see the same kind of resilience, the same kind of commitment, the same refusal to accept defeat. Indeed, it's a move that's more than a symbol. Chrysler House is further proof that for this company, Detroit is also a home. Reporting for Chrysler Electronic Communications, I'm Ed Garston.